वेलकम फ्रेंड्स टू माई चैनल ट्रेडिंग सेंसेशन आई होप यू ऑल एट बींग वेल येस फ्रेंड्स लास्ट वीक वॉज अ ब्लॉक बस्टर वीक नॉट ओनली इन टर्म्स ऑफ निफ्टी बट ओवरऑल सिनारियो वी हैड टू मेजर इवेंट्स वन वॉज बजट एंड द अदर वन वॉज आर बी आई बाई मंथली पॉलिसी नाउ इन दिस पर्टिकुलर वीडियो आई हैव प्रिपेयर वन एक्सेल विच कैन हेल्प यू गोइंग फॉरवर्ड बिकॉज यू नो दैट फ्यूचर गेट्स बिल्ट based on past data points right so please do watch it till the end if you want some value to take out from this particular video and don't forget to subscribe my channel and hit the notification bell so uh, i have uh, created few columns you can see that uh, the first column is all about sectors so i have segregated the list of sectors into 30 parts approx clear and uh, then you have uh, two columns on the right side one named as uh, 15th jan 2021 and the other one is uh, 31st jan 2021 so uh, this 15th jan 2021 reflects uh, what amount of money in crores remember the unit is in crores not in dollar not in other format clear so uh, this figure is all about equity and this is also all about equity no other asset class and uh, this 15 jan basically reflects what has happened in the previous weeks before 15th jan and this 31st jan reflects what has happened from this 16th jan to 30th or 31st jan clear so uh, it reflects what it reflects the amount of money that foreign investors invested into equities in these respective sectors i hope this video will add or throw lot of light to you please do watch it minutely so at the top you can see its automobile and auto components you know that every company has its equity its debt and different other asset classes correct so here we will only focus on equity so in this particular sector foreign investors till 15 jan 2021 invested into equity and the amount stands for 2798 crore and from 15 jan to 31st jan foreign investors invested into equity in this automobiles and auto components sector and the amount stands for 685 crore now let's go one by one on the downside and let's see that what has happened so then it is followed by total financial services so total financial services has been segregated into two parts that is one is banks and the other one is other financial services which is other than banks clear so financial services minus banks stands for other financial services so in banks you can see till 15 jan there was some kind of outflow which stands for minus 524 crore and in uh, till 31st jan also there was outflow that is minus 3384 clear and in other financial services you see that the foreign investors invested 771771 crore till 15 jan and from 16 to 31 jan they invested minus 380 that means 380 crore came out from this particular other financial services sector clear now then we have capital goods here in capital goods you see that uh, the amount was 2714 till 15th jan 2021 and from that day till 31st jan it's 907 crore clear now then we have chemicals and petrochemicals which is 403 and then it is 388 and you can see as i go down as i scroll down i have a list of almost 30 sectors clear almost 30 sectors here you see uh, you can see that there are 35 it is written but you see under transportation there are many sub parts that is airlines logistics 
marine roads and highways shipping surface transportation transport related services and airport services basically i have segregated these things uh, which will help me to boil down into individual stocks and then get the overall idea so basically it's a top down approach clear now friend you see that uh, till 15 jan if you just see till the end maximum money came into automobiles and auto components clear it was followed by capital goods which was 2714 crore and then it was all about metals and minings 1986 and then household and personal products 1042 it was the scenario till 15th jan my friend now let's focus on 31st Jan. So till 31st Jan, if you just uh, see the data point, the maximum investment came into this uh, oil and gas sector. Clear? It was followed by software and services and then it was followed by healthcare services. So my friend, uh, one needs to look only the top three to five sectors where the money went into and top three to five sectors from where the money came out. So uh, till 31st Jan, the top sector has been oil and gas, which got reflected into oil stocks. If you go to individual oil stocks like BPCL, ONGC, Oil India, etc., you will see those stocks went higher in the past weeks. Correct. So uh, it was followed by software services and then it's healthcare services. Now, uh, if we see the outflow, let's focus on the outflow. So in these banks, foreign investors are basically taking out their money. So the amount stands for 3384 crore in negative terms. That means outflow, clear? So uh, financial services, I mean, the foreign investors are bearish on financial services. It is followed by construction materials, consumer durables. And uh, if you just go down further, you will get few more like pharma as well. Clear? So uh, this is the overall structure of the money flow of foreign investors. I hope from this particular video, you will get an edge to think that how or what they are thinking going forward. Clear? Please don't forget to like the video and share it with your near and dear ones. Thanks for watching. Goodbye.